All right, today's first look takes us west to Rocky River. A longtime establishment is getting some new life. Our digital anchor Stephanie Haney joins us live from Sam and Dave's. Stephanie, tell us what's new there. Oh my gosh, everything is new here. The decor, the menu, I'm talking about the food and the cocktail. So to really bring us in on this, I've got two executives from hospitality restaurants here with me. We've got PJ Syracuse here on my left, Chris Neeland here on my right. An incredible renovation that they've done here. Chris, I have to ask you, I'll start with you first. What was it about the timing that was right in order to catch the vibe up to what you're creating here at Sam and Dave's? We're celebrating 30 years. Uh, we opened this restaurant in 1993 and we thought, what better way to celebrate than a brand new menu, a fresh new look, elevated cocktails, giving you the same great service. Okay, so talk to me a little bit about what transformed here, about the old look, which we've got some pictures to show of, that brought us up to where we are today. Well, as you can see when you walk in, we step, we definitely wanted to kind of remain Sam and Dave's. We wanted to keep the arches. The moose is still here. We asked about the moose. We've got a great mahogany bar, but we wanted to bring a fresh coastal feel. Uh, the vibe is new. It's fresh, clean, lighter colors, kept the tile floors. So it's really vibrant right now, as you can see with a full bar right now. <laughs> yes, that dedicated happy hour crew for sure. And the menu has been revamped as well. So PJ, tell me about some of the things you've got to, that you can look forward to coming in here. Well, the menu itself has been uh, inspired coastal comfort, we call it. Um, we kind of refer to it as a seven-day menu, meaning really for any occasion, whether you're coming in for anniversary or a birthday. Um, obviously, we've kind of paired up our raw bar. Uh, we have a Cleveland Coastal favorite, which is going to be our fish and chips. Uh, All right, I'm just going to try a bite of this while you're telling me about it. Oh, my it. gosh, yes. Uh, triple cooked JoJo fries as well. Okay. And you have to dip a little bit in the Bertram's mustard tartar sauce as well, which is fantastic. All right, when you try the food, you got to wash it down with something. So what can you tell me, Chris, about the special cocktails we have now? Well, we kind of, as I said, we did elevated cocktails. So we always felt that people come to Sam and Dave's and have drinks. We wanted people to come to Sam and Dave's for the drinks. So these are three of our most popular right now. We've got the Italian espresso martini, the French 75, and the sidecar, which is a classic cocktail with our Sam and Dave's elevated twist. And when we were searching for a beer list, we got this Narragansett um, lobster beer. It's a blonde ale. We thought the can was fantastic. It fits right in. I personally couldn't be happier in this happy hour myself, Chris and PJ. That is a really good espresso martini. And I, I may have had an espresso martini or two in my day. Thank you so much for having us here today. Appreciate it. Jay, Christy, they've got happy hour every single day here. I don't know what could be happy hour, happier than that. It's from <laughs> 2 to 6 on Fridays. It starts at 2 on Saturday and Sundays, and then every day from 3 to 6 the rest of the week. So. Yeah, come early because that yeah. bar fills up fast, as you can see. And I can confirm that you have tried one of those martinis a time or two. <laughs> I can confirm that. Yes, so that, just that is absolutely true. <laughs> nice. Stephanie, thank you very much. Have a great weekend.